Hey there fellow Tenno, welcome to a Warframe Guide with Energize. Today we shall be taking a look into XP farming and how to level up fast. But it all depends on your level and skill in game. There are a few missions that will gain you a large sum of XP. The first mission, and personally my favourite, is located on Eris. Select the mission Akkad and prepare for a defence mission against the infested. The enemies are high levels from the get go and tend to rise up to around level 90 when you get to weight 30. If you are a skilled Tenno, then you should be able to survive the nasty looking creatures that you shall face. In order to gain the maximum XP from this mission, you will need a total of 4 players. All 4 players must stay in the area and keep close at all times as the XP is multiplied and shared. To see when other Tenno are nearby, simply look to the top right hand side of the screen and you should see a tiny little symbol. If there are three players with you, then it should say three when all players are close to each other, thus maximizing the total XP shared. Using this mission is personally my go-to place to farm up that tasty XP and level up my frames and weapons to 30 in no time. In fact, it will only take 30 waves of this mission to level an unranked weapon up to level 30, meaning you can do it in one solid run. Warframes tend to take a little longer to level up and may take more waves to hit level 30, or you could simply start a fresh game and repeat. Now if you are slightly worried about the high level enemies and aren't so keen on the big action, then don't lose your head. There is a second mission that will boost your weapons up nicely until you are confident enough to attack those beasts of war. Head over to Mercury and select the Apologurus mission. This is a survival mission against the infested. They are however a lot lower leveled and hardly do any damage to your frame at all. All you have to do is keep the oxygen flowing nicely and kill the beasts. This way will level your weapons and frames to a nice starter level so you can put some good mods on for some extra damage. You won't earn anywhere near as much XP as Akkad, but it is still a good starting point for the newer Tenno. Now that your weapons are built in your foundry, you can try this method out for yourself. If you enjoyed this guide or found it helpful, then make sure to give it a thumbs up. Want more guides on how to become the ultimate Tenno? Click the subscribe button for more soon to come. Thank you for watching, and peace.